Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Duggar, always on board, and it's been a few months since I've uploaded a Premiere Pro tutorial, but this is by request, so there's a lot of people out there who want to get rid of these black bars. Um, it makes your videos not professional, not full screen, and that's one of the first things that you want to learn when, once you start uploading videos is how to make it look professional like everyone else is on YouTube, so it's a very easy thing to do. So what you have to do is make sure that uh, you are clicked onto your video, and once clicked on it, you go up here to Effect Controls, and then uh, if it's like this, drop down motion. And then from here, you have the scale options. And this is where you can scale it up to where it fits 100%. And let's say uh, I fit it to um, well to 69, but uh, I filled it to a point where just the tops need to be fixed. Well, there's a few different things that you can do with this. You can uh, take away this uniform scale, unclick that, and then uh, scale width left and right. And then you can scale um, the height. So let's say I want to make this perfectly like this, so like that's the height, and then that's the width, and so there you go, now it's full screen HD. Um, and let's say you want to save that preset so that you don't have to go and in, go into the video uh, settings and do that every time you upload a video. Uh, what you do is you right click over this little uh, box next to motion, and go to save preset, and then once you want to use it again, let's say um, it's all messed up. Let's say it's like this and I want to use my preset so that this video is full screen, all you do is come down to the bottom left to effects and then uh, when you save your uh, preset to whatever name you just go down here and find it and mine is tut. Uh, so from here I just uh, drag that in and it fills the screen back up. Um, and then you might have to tweak it. I, I didn't set it for uh, exactly how it should be so from here what I would need to do is I would need to um, bump this part up and then I forgot to tell you guys that position right here um, the first one is X, uh, so that moves left and right, and the second one's Y, so if you need to fit it to the middle of the screen. Okay, and so I'll move this over a little bit, and then there you go. Pretty much that's full screen, and then I can stretch that and that. So it's not 100% perfect, it's a tutorial, but uh, it's a pretty easy thing for you guys to do, so I hope you guys learned uh, it, something in this tutorial, because I think that that's pretty basic and straightforward. Um, so just to go over exactly what it was, you click over the video, come up here to effect controls, drop down motion, you can scale it up, and then uh, fit it to what you like. You can save it as a preset by right clicking and clicking on save preset, and then typing in what you would like. Um, and then yeah, that's pretty much it. So my name is Duggar, always on board. Thank you guys for watching. Go ahead and leave a rating on this video and check out the videos at the end of this one for more tutorials. So see you guys later.